Now first let me introduce my team. I've got Hasegawa here on the Lith Throne and Evo on the End Throne. Hello gents. Uh, we're, pre we're presenting here efficient and multi-flexible print solutions for you today. Uh, both of these presses are making their debut here at Jupiter 2012. Here we have the new Lithrone A37, the 37 of course referring to 37 inches and it has a maximum sheet size of 640 by 940. Okay, we're going to be doing two jobs on both presses. Now, this is actually a double sized cylinder configuration. It's a multi flexible press and it's capable of printing eight up in positions of either 11, uh, 8A4 sizes or letter size, American letter size. Now, here we have the five color Enthrone 29P, which is a compact press and it features an onboard operation system down here at the end where Evo is and it's capable of printing high quality thanks to a configuration that's mainly composed of double size cylinders and this is actually config uh, configured here with a perfecting mechanism between units two and three so it provides even higher cost performance benefits to you and your customers okay let's start the show shall we Hasegawa let's get started with our first job which is the poster Let's get started. Now, the development concept of the new Lithrone A37 is an affordable, simple, easy to operate 13,000 SPH press. Now, it is suitable for most types of work in a size that minimizes waste. Many options, including automation, are also available on this press. But the biggest feature, however, is that it covers the paper size of the 40 inches, which is uh, Kamori's best-selling G40, and the 32 inches of the Lithrone S32. So we just check in the first couple of sheets of our poster, and then we'll change over to present to do this, which is an eight up in position of a fashion magazine cover. And even with an eight-page A4 job, you can still see we've got space there for the colour bar. Now, the Lithrone A37 can easily produce high-quality printed products. And that's because it's an extension of the solid double-sized cylinder construction of the Lithrone G40. Okay, so first job is done. Thank you, Hasegawa. Evo, should we get started on the end throne? Good o. Okay, a major sales point of the Lithrone A37 is its ability to accommodate a wide variety of impositions, as we spoke about, in the reduced sheet format. For example, the LA37 is suitable for popular standard sizes in China and India. And also in America, take a look at the screen. On screen there you can see an 8 page imposition of American letter sized pages. 11 inches by 8.5 inches. And again you can see the colour bar there. Also note the maximum sheet thickness on the A37 is 0.6mm. And we can start at 0.04mm on this press. But we are now starting to change over and change the first plate. Morning, gents. Now, we've actually got a tool free plate clamping system on this Lithrone. Takedo is able, has a gower even, is able to change the plates quickly and simply without needing to use any tools whatsoever. Sorry, Hasagawa. Now, you can see how smooth that is with a live camera feed. So if you don't need a 40 inch press and you don't need full automation, then maybe this press is something you might like to consider for your workplace. And we're going to come to the end throne very soon. We've done our first job there also. So we're about to change over on the end throne to the second job. And we're changing thicknesses on the end throne. And I'll show you uh, the samples in just a sec. So simply just clamping it on now by hand. That's the first unit done. 
But how do all these benefits benefit you in terms of savings? In terms of compared to a 40 inch press well first of all there's the space saving which is pretty obvious but compared to our um, G40 this is 1,500 millimeters shorter so therefore it can leave room for the installation of other equipment when press room space is limited next there's power saving of course compared to our 40 inch press the Lithrone A37 offers a 38 percent reduction of power consumption and as for saving on running costs the LA37's plate size gives you a 20% cost reduction and all of these comprehensive savings are going to give you very high cost performance in all countries around the world I'm gonna come over here if I <laughs> do a little dance <coughs> now another benefit of the Lithrone A37 is that it can be optionally equipped with many of Komori's technologies which were developed for the Lithrone S series and G series presses. You could for example choose to have HUV drying system and that will give you powderless and instant drying so that work can be automatically finished as soon as they come off the press. We were talking, we've got a tool-free clamping system on this press as standard. However, you could opt for a semi-APC, it's a benderless semi-APC uh, plate changing system on here, which is exactly what we have on the end throne. But plate changing with our standard system is four and a half minutes on the Lithrone A37. In addition to semi-APC, this press can also be optionally specified with the latest um, <coughs> labour saving technologies including the PDC density control system and even the KHS AI system which has that self-learning function for single step register adjustment and colour matching. And that of course saves you a huge amount of waste at print startup. Excuse me. Now, for details on specifications and options on this press, then please chat to one of our staff on the stand at the end of this demonstration. Okay, let's now have a little look at some advanced technologies in incorporated in the press under the heading of high quality, if you'd like to take a look at the video. For the sheet feeding performance of the Lithron A37, the latest technologies inherited from the Lithron S series are incorporated. The sucker box is the type proven in 16,000 sheets per hour duty, ensuring stable sheet feeding with a wide range of papers from thin sheets to thick sheets. The suction tape feeder of the air suction paper transport system reliably transports all grades of paper to the printing unit. An oil-free design is used for the gripper shaft. This prevents accidents caused by oil scattering. For dampening, the Komori-matic continuous dampening system is adopted, which provides an even, stable, thin film of water by means of its reverse slip system. This system also enables non-alcohol printing. The inker incorporates fountain keys, ink roller array, and roller pressure follow mechanism inherited from the Lithron S series, guaranteeing high print quality. Okay, let's just quickly summarize again the main benefits of the new Lithron A37. The most important point is the maximum sheet size of 640 by 940 millimeters, and it's capable of handling eight up impositions of American letter sizes or a4 size pages as well as papers up to 37 inches wide. The press makes the most of the paper size and also ensures high cost performance. Plus of course it can be optionally equipped with Komori's advanced technologies beginning with HUV and KHS AI. We believe that printers around the world will be able to make the most of the benefits of the LA37. So as you can see, we're gearing up now to start our second job. 
which is the, um, the fashion magazine. Something else to consider, though, is that the Lithrone A37 it requires no gripper pad height adjustment, and the sheet thickness range is 0.04 millimetres to 0.6 millimetres. And any other adjustments necessary are very simple and easy to do from the console. So just moving on to our second job on both presses. Sheets will be checked and then we'll go into production of 200 sheets. We've ne kind of neglected the end throne till now, so let's now move on to the 29P, which is an ultra compact press which allows installation even in restricted workspaces. And by positioning the operating panel down here at the end where Evo is, on the press itself, the total length of the machine is substantially reduced. Plus, of course, we have the step-free operator side design here, which means that the machine width is also minimised. So just checking that job, Hasegawa is. But this is actually a perfecter version of the Enthrone 529 which is a new addition to the Enthrone range, and we're exhibiting this for the very first time here at Drupa. It's a five-colour machine, and it incorporates the sheet turning system here between units two and three with a double-double single transfer cylinder array. And then we have double-sized cylinders in between the other coloured units. Now, the sheet turning or perfecting system can run in straight or perfecting mode, and the change from straight to perfecting is automatic, and it takes uh, three minutes, and Evo would simply just push a button here on the delivery console to do that. Now, for perfecting printing, the maximum speed is 11,000 sheets per hour. And the sheet thickness range is 0.04 millimetres to 0.3. Thank you, Hasegawa. Job done. Excellent. Oh. Now, the behaviour of paper during perfecting here on the end throne is very stable. You can see the monitor here, the impression cylinder, which follows on from perfecting, has a special long-life ceramic jacket and that eliminates the possibility of scratches or marking on the side of the sheet that was printed first. Now, simply by pressing the PDCSE button, which we've just done, densities are automatically measured and then automatically adjusted by means of the close-loop feedback function. You can see there the colours. If they are green and yellow, they're acceptable and we can go ahead and print, which is what we're doing. Okay, so one job is using heavy stock, 200 sheets of a postcard job, and that's from the award-winning Kamori calendar. And this is our second job. Now, because there's no gripper pad height adjustment needed, changeover from thick to thin paper is performed automatically simply by pushing a button. So you don't have to hold up your production line and do jobs of similar thicknesses at the same time. So you can react to your customers much more quickly, giving you the edge over your competition. And this is our second job here. Here we have Kamori's head office in Tokyo's Asakusa. In the background, the Tokyo Skytree, set to open on May the 22nd. It's the world's largest communications tower at 634 metres. A little bit of trivia there for you this morning. But what you can see is quality and cost shouting out loud from this end throne. It, it's a compact press that can make you money in many, many ways on both thin and thick paper. And the new Lithrone A37, our new multi-flex compact press, can handle a wide variety of impositions. So just think how much you could improve your bottom line if you had these presses in your factory. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Thank you to my guys, Hasegawa and Evo. Marvellous. Um, and if you want any samples, please help yourself. And if you have any questions, just shout. But do come and join us on the Kamori stand. Have a, um, a little, there's loads more demonstrations going on throughout the day. Thank you.